you've watched this channel for about two seconds, you know that we have a lot of love for Viking, former Vikings legendary quarterback Kyle Jerome Ezekiel Sluter. That's right, 2017 UDFA out of Northern Colorado. He was a preseason superstar for the Vikings. Didn't get along with Zimmer. He, he was a patient zero for not getting along with Zim. Just a, a lot. Plus, he was back for the first time last season. Because remember, Zimmer and Spielman... They, they weren't uh, getting along, right? And when Kirk Cousins went down with the Rona, they had they, they signed Kyle Sluter because Spielman just wanted to piss off Zimmer. Just like, ah, got you, man. Because they could have signed any backup quarterback in the known universe, and they picked Sluter, the guy who Zimmer did not like. It's hilarious, man. Uh, but then Kyle was a first-round pick uh, by the uh, uh, New Orleans Breakers in the inaugural season of the revived USFL. Uh, he was first-team All-USFL where he, he didn't put up the greatest stats, Frankly, I'm surprised that he made first team, but it is what it is. Led the Breakers in, uh, to the playoffs. Didn't quite get it done championship-wise, but it is what it is. And now he is back. He is back. Bob Gobble, that's Kyle Sluter's music. Uh, he assigned with the Jacksonville Jaguars uh, per Tom Pelissero and also per er, everyone. And I'm rooting for him, man. I, I, I am because I actually do think that, hey, Trevor Lawrence, pissing your pants yet? That's right, man. All right, so I understand that Trevor Lawrence was the number one overall pick, and I understand that he did okay last season under very trying circumstances with that uh, five-ring circus uh, that was uh, the Urban Meyer uh, tenure. But nah, 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 nah. Because I do think that it would not be insane if Kyle Sluter wins the QB job with the Jaguars. I, I really don't. So Doug Peterson uh, is now in charge. He is a player's coach, uh, and then he can work with uh, quarterbacks. Uh, there are sort of misfits, especially uh, quarterbacks with a little bit of mobility. And they got Trevor Lawrence up there as QB1. I actually do think that uh, Jacksonville can improve this season. Offensive line still, yeah. Uh, but they did add a bunch of weapons in free agency as well as the draft. Uh, C.J. Uh, Beathard, uh, a.k.a. C.J. Beat Hard. Yeah, it, it, it won't be hard to beat C.J. for that quarterback two spot, uh, as I, I do think that Kyle Sluter slides on in. Jake Luton, uh, the, the pride of Oregon State, who's bounced around the league uh, to a degree. He's actually started. It's kind of crazy. Uh, but he uh, is probably not going to be much competition. And then you have the rookie UDFA E.J. Perry coming out of Brown. Yeah, that, that's the color of his shorts right now, uh, learning that he has to compete with Kyle Suter. Uh, that's right, man. So I, I'm rooting for him because I, 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 I'm I still attached to him, mainly because I, I feel like he never got a full fair shot with the Vikings. And I, I do think that it sort of tainted uh, his reputation as he bounced around the league. He was a backup with the Lions and the Bears and uh, just really uh, becoming a journeyman before he found some footing in the USFL. Uh, gets another chance in the National Football League. And I, I think that... He still has a chance to be a little something something because he's got good mobility. He's got a big time arm. Uh, he has some leadership uh, qualities to him, and I think that he has matured. I think that he's learned a lot throughout this journey. And if he does get a fair shake in Jacksonville, uh, I wouldn't be shocked at all if he gets the quarterback two job behind Trevor Lawrence. So I'm uh, rooting for him. Ooh, and if it goes down, if he becomes a Jacksonville Jaguars backup quarterback, uh, this will officially be a backup Jaguars account. Right, so Vikings in the NFC, Jaguars in the AFC. We're gonna be one of those jabronis, man. But getting it, I can't help but root for the pride of Northern Colorado, Kyle Jerome Ezekiel Suter. But that's it. Uh, Suter signs with the Jaguars. Remember, it's a Dutch pronunciation. Uh, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.